Judge Gonzalez, are Republicans listening to the point that Judge Ludic is making? You know, he's sort of, as you are, you know, an icon and important figure in Republican politics. And if they're not listening, how do you expect or hope to get through to them? Well, I mean, I have a great deal of respect for Judge Ludic, uh, and uh, more so because of his service on the bench. He was just a, a great judge. Uh, you know, as to whether or not, you know, for the longest time, because um, there's been sort of crazy rhetoric out there for many, many years uh, so surrounding former President Trump. And for the longest time, I just sort of ignored it as silly. Uh, but um, for quite some time now, I've come to the conclusion that it's too dangerous to ignore it. And so it is important for uh, people in the Republican Party um, to speak out for what for the rhetoric and activities that we that we fundamentally know in our deep in our hearts that it's wrong and we need to speak out against it because oftentimes words turn into action and uh you know we're starting to see some of that and so we I, I think it's very very important for people the leadership of the republican party and not just because it's good for the party there's no question about that in my judgment given the recent string of, of a, a losses that we've had, the party has had in recent elections, but it's good for the country, uh, quite frankly. I, I think to have two strong parties uh, that, are, that produce um, strong ethical candidates uh, that present compelling choices on both sides to the American voter, that's the kind of system we ought to have in place. I think that's the system that, that our founding fathers uh, had in mind. And so I'm hoping we get to that. Uh, I'm, I'd like to think that with with each passing indictment and with the passage of time, uh, that as more people speak out, a uh, groundswell will will begin, and people will come to understand the importance of of uh, being patient, not criticizing the process, letting the process play out. And it may turn out that Donald Trump is is uh, exonerated on every single count. And if so that I would accept it because I accept our system of government. It's not perfect, but uh, we have a system in place. It is the rule of law and we accept the outcome, whatever, whatever it may be. And I'd like more Americans, I like all Americans to feel the same way.